got everything you need all in one spot, in one location. You have, you know, you have your track, you have your basketball court where you can get your drill work in, you can get your playing in, and you've got the weight room right next to it. We also do things to uh, work and strengthen in, you know, our ankles as well. We've got the sand pit outside. So you've got everything that you need in one spot. You don't have to travel to different places to get everything that you need. And then even after you're done training, if you need ice, we've got that as well. Mentally, I feel wonderful. Um, you can always get stronger mentally. And I, I feel like this game, uh, basketball, is you know pretty much either 80 or 90 percent mental anyway. And uh, there's, there's been situations here where it's, it's really challenged me mentally. And, and I've been able to overcome that. And I think that's helped me mature and grow a little bit more physically. I feel outstanding. You know, I wake up every morning. I'm excited to move around. My, my body feels a lot stronger, you know. Um, I'm, I'm leaner, but I still maintain my strength. So sometimes I have a tendency to uh, get a little upset when people tell me I'm skinnier because I, I know I'm still just as strong, maybe stronger than I was before. But uh, mentally, I'm prepared going into this upcoming season. I think I'm going to do great. And. Uh I think a lot of basketball players, um, when when they come to the gym, most of the time, you know, they want to get you want to get a good, quick lift in. You don't want to be too long, and you don't want to bulk up. Uh, a lot of guys are more into the maintaining their physical strength and not necessarily gaining a lot of strength because you don't want to look bulky. And um, here, I've I've learned that you know you can maintain your strength, you can actually get stronger and still stay lean. It just takes dedication. It takes a little bit of commitment, you know, hard work, you know, sacrifice, and you just got to believe in it. You just got to be consistent with everything. You can't go, you know, two days on, you know, five days off. But if you're committed to it and you do it over a period of time, it, it works out and it does wonders. The environment here is wonderful. Uh, I love the atmosphere. You know, you come into a weight room where everyone's excited to lift. You know, you got you got good music you can listen to as well when you're working out. Uh, I'm one of those guys that I get I get motivated real easily. You know, and um, all the trainers here they push you hard. You know, they don't they don't take it easy on anyone. You know, so it makes you not take anything for granted. When you come in, you're gonna get your work in. You're gonna get out. Very unique. Uh, it's different. In the past few years, I've worked with several trainers, and um, they've all had uh, individual attention. So that that part, that aspect from all trainers is pretty good. But here at uh, at DST, there's there's a little bit of difference with as far as the assessment is categorizing the different injuries that you have and working towards strengthening those as well as you know trying to meet your goals and your needs and things that you need. Uh, I think individually, me as a person here, I've I've learned a lot in the past, you know, few months as far as strength training and how to maintain strength and also lose weight at the same time. So I'm able to maintain my speed and you know get stronger. So I'm able to still guard quicker guys in the league and also have the ability to play a little bit down on the post as well. Mike Harrison, I'm a DST athlete.